Nishinoya created the group chat mission Enatana. Nishinoya added Akashi, Tendao, Sugura, Yaku, Kenma, Hanamaki, Oikoa, Kunami, Hinata, Yamaguchi, Atsumu, Suna, Yachi, Semi and Yahaba to the group chat. Guys. You know how Tanaka always complains about being lonely and shit. Yes. What about it? I just discovered something amazing. Wala. Tell us Noya Senpei. Everything for my dear Kauhei. Have you guys noticed the way Tanaka and Anoshita look at each other? It's very hard to miss. Yes. I think they are really into each other. Nor. Little Ryu-chan is in love. Says Mr. Head over heels for Iwa-chan. But just look at him. He's so perfect. Sim. Boaha. I couldn't have said it better. Back to the topic. What are we going to do about Tanaka and Anoshita? Yes. I really want them to be with each other. Same. So I have a plan. Kinda. It's not complete but it's something. Tell us. So. I think it's best if Anoshita confesses. I can see that. Tanaka is amazing, but he's bad with words sometimes and a little bit too straightforward. Then it's best if Inoshita confesses. We should bring them together somewhere this Sunday. Why this Sunday? Shocked Oiko noises. Don't tell me you forgot, Mori-chan. What did it I forgot? What is this Sunday? Valentine's Day of course. Oh right. Who gives a fuck about Valentine's anyway? My poor Kindechi. I think I can talk Inoshita into this and convince him to confess to our dear Ryunasuke. Yes. Where will their meeting place be? I'll make sure Tanaka is there. You know that big Sakura tree in that park between their houses? That's the perfect place. My bro will finally be in a relationship. Yes. By the way. I think you is going to start a new challenge any second now. I just feel it. Boyfriend awards group chat. Everyone wake up. You'll never guess what day it is tomorrow. Yes Mori-chan. Tell us which day it is tomorrow. Fuck you. I'm missing something. Just go on. Ignore them. Like I do with my problems and responsibilities. Dot. 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 Okay okay. I got the score from last challenge. Yes yes. We need that. So. The third place is stolen by our favorite Russian guy and his libero. Wait. How did we win? Just. How did we manage to do that? Just being cute. The only thing Lev can do is being an idiot. That poor Russian guy. How did he end up dating such a Tsundir? Dot. 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 The second place goes to the kitten and his rooster. Oh. Nice I guess. No further reaction? Where is the enthusiasm? This is Kenma we're talking about. I can kinda relate to him. Do you know how exhausting being enthusiast is? Exactly. How can people have that much energy? Finally someone who understands me. Dot. 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 Anyway. The observant eyes have noticed that one couple is missing in the ranks so far. Now that you mention it. Akashi. Go get your prize. Dot. 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 The first place is indeed for Akashi and his Bakuto. How is it possible that we claim a spot in the top three every time? Just. How? Because you two are fucking adorable. That's why. I can't disagree with that. For real though. But you guys know what day it is tomorrow, right? Of course bro. It's Valentine's Day. Yes bro. So because of this very special day, I have a brand new task for my dear candidates. I want everyone to text their boyfriends and ask them what their plans are for tomorrow. Nice thinking bro. I know right. That isn't so bad I guess. I agree with that. So go go go. Go get your screenshots and cheesy answers. Tsukishima and Yamaguchi. Tsuki. Um? You know it's Valentine's Day tomorrow, right? Yes. You're probably going to ask for my plans tomorrow. Am I right? Eh <laughs> You know me too well. Don't worry. I have something planned and I think you will like it. Well. Seriously? Yes. I was thinking about a picnic during the sunset. We can bring your ukulele along and just enjoy the sunset, the food and your music. This is so cute. I literally can't wait. Don't get your hopes too high. Otherwise it'll be disappointing. It'll be amazing for sure. I'm with you after all. 
So what can go wrong? That was so cheesy. He gomant sucky. But it's the truth. Whatever. Hinata and Kajiyama. Kajiyama. You know what day it is tomorrow, right? Yes. It's Sunday. Why? No. That's not what I meant. What did you mean then? Is tomorrow something special? Yes. It's Valentine's Day tomorrow, Baka. Oh right. I never really celebrated that. It kinda slipped my mind. Do you have plans for tomorrow? Not really. I mean, what are you supposed to do on Valentine's Day? I don't really get it. Well, it's a day where we kinda celebrate the love. How do I explain it? Usually, couples get each other gifts like chocolate and flowers and spend more time with each other than normal. I don't really get it though. I think I understand it better than a few moments ago. Let's play some more volleyball tomorrow. That's not really romantic, but it sounds even better. Forget the flowers and chocolate. At the end of the day I can get you some meat buns. Those are way better. Well, I'm looking forward to it. This is how I like to spend with you tomorrow. Daichi and Sugora. Daichi. Yes sugar? So, you know what day it is tomorrow, right? Yes. Do you maybe have some plans for tomorrow? Yes I have plans. I plan to be with this silver haired angel all day long. LKSDJF. I'm not an angel. But that sounds like a very good plan. So tomorrow, you, me, the chocolate I bought and a ton of cheesy romance movies? Yes. I can't wait. Yachi and Kyoko. Kyoko. Um. Do you maybe have some plans for tomorrow? Because if you don't, I think it'll be really nice to spend the day with you. My only plan for tomorrow is to spend the day with you baby. Really? Yes. Thanks Kyoko. This really made me happy. Everything for my sweet little girlfriend. Nishinoya and Asahi. Asahi I. What are your plans for tomorrow? I was thinking about that. But to be honest, I don't really know. Don't worry. I have the perfect idea. This makes me actually really scared. KLSDFJ. It's a good one. Believe me. You know that new trampoline park that opened next to the mall? Yes. Let's go there tomorrow. It'll be fun. Actually, I think that's a perfect idea. That will be so much fun. I know right. Let's meet up there at 2. Okay. See you tomorrow baby. Well I'll see you tomorrow. Semi and Shiribu. Shiribu. You know what day it is tomorrow, right? Yes. It's Sunday, right? February the 14th. Yes. And you know what kind of day that date is, right? Yes. I'm not stupid. It's Valentine's Day tomorrow. So. Since we are dating. Are we going to do something tomorrow? Do you want to do something tomorrow? To be honest, I don't really give a fuck about the label Valentine's Day because yeah, I think it's something commercials. But if you want to do something special or something, we could. I don't want to do something in particular. Maybe we can just hang out and listen to that new album from that band. That one that you like so much? Yes. Okay. Sure I guess. Sounds fun. Can you maybe bring your guitar? Why? I don't know. I just like how you play. It's comfortable. Sure I guess. My house at one. Yes. See you tomorrow baby. See you tomorrow. Tendo and Ashijima. Wakatoshi. Do you have any plans for tomorrow? Why should I have any plans for tomorrow? You know what day it is tomorrow, right? Of course. It's the 14th of February. No baby. Something special is tomorrow. Really? I didn't know that. It's Valentine's tomorrow Ushi. Valentine's. I think I've heard some things about that, but I'm not quite certain what this entails. It's basically a day where couples do all kinds of romantic things together. They buy gifts for each other, mostly chocolate and flowers, and it's just a day all about love. Oh, I get it I think. I had originally planned to work on my farm tomorrow. We really need to keep the stables clean. It maybe sounds like a weird and not so romantic date, but do you maybe want to join me? Of course I want to join. I want to see my little lamb again. He's so sweet and fluffy. That's the reason why I called him after you after all. Kyotony and Yahaba. Madag-chan. 
You know it's Valentine's Day tomorrow, right? Yes. Why? So, did you plan something for tomorrow? Why should I? It's just a normal day every day. Just a normal Sunday. Why should I behave all love a because of a stupid title? I don't know. Maybe because it's romantic or something and you want to be a good boyfriend or something? So I'm a good boyfriend if I do something on that stupid day? Now that you say it in this way, I kinda agree with you. We can still do some nice things you know. But I don't want to do those weird romantic things just because it's Valentine's Day. Okay. Let's meet at my place. Okay. Kunami and Kindechi. Hey Kindechi. Did you plan something for tomorrow? I just wanted to ask you the same thing. I think it's nice to do something on Valentine's Day, but only if you want to. I want to. If it doesn't take too much energy, I'm in. Okay. How about we watch a movie? I'll take care of the snacks and movie. We can just watch and cuddle for the whole night. That sounds good. I'm in. Yay. Iwazumi and Oikoa. Iwa. You'll never guess what day it is tomorrow. It's Valentine's Day tomorrow. How did I know that? Because you keep talking about it all the time. Sorry. I'm just really excited. I know Toru. We're going to make the most out of it, okay? Yes. So I was thinking about dinner at that new restaurant opened. That Italian one? Yes. Well, that would be lovely. Can we go have a movie night after that? Sure. But I'm not going to watch alien movies all night. No no no. You can choose a movie this time. Really? Yes. If it isn't something about Godzilla, I'll be satisfied. Okay. I'll pick you up at 7. So make sure you're ready. Yes I will. I'm so excited. We're going to make it a beautiful day. Toru, Panamaki and Matsukoa. Hello hello. Who's there? Give me some hints. Uem. Iwa-chan. Oikoa. Yes bitch. I knew it. But you know what day it is tomorrow, right? Of course I know. Do you like jazz? Boahaha. I didn't knew Atsumu had another twin. This is really scary. Wait. I found something. Borjajja. Why do we watch horror movies when we have this? Exactly. Anyway. I have the best date organized for us tomorrow. So I was thinking. You know how much of a romantic a Soiko is? Of course I know. I was thinking, you, me, and stalking Oikoas and I were Chan's date for the tea. Perfect date. Kenma and Kiru. Hey Kiru. So tomorrow is Valentine's Day. Do you have some plans? I sure have some. Does it involve being involved with people? If you count me as an alien, no, no people except me. Thanks. That means a lot. Of course. I think you will absolutely love tomorrow. You know that game that you kept talking about last week's? Of course I know that game. Otherwise I wouldn't be talking about it. So, I maybe bought it so we can play tomorrow, all day long. Wait. Kiru. Are you serious right now? 100% serious kitten. No. Really. Yes. Tomorrow will be only us and this new game. I even bought a starlight projector so the room will give off a complete different vibe than usual. It'll be like we're outside under the starry sky, but in reality, we're warm inside with each other in this game. Kiru. I'm so happy. You are amazing. I know I am. Yaku and Lev. Lev. Do you have some plans for tomorrow? Maybe I have. Maybe I don't. That's for me to know and for you to find out. Don't go around joking now. I just want an answer. You'll find out tomorrow. Be dressed up and prepared at 5 p.m. And maybe a certain tall silver-haired Russian boy will come by and pick you up. Okay. I'll be ready then. Yay. Sakusa and Atsumu. Omi Omi Kun. Do you have plans for Valentine's Day tomorrow? Maybe. What do you mean maybe? I mean it exactly the way you see it. But it's so unclear. 
So vague. You'll see what I mean tomorrow. Wait. Are you planning something? Omi? Come back. Time skip. The next day. This happens in real life. Atsumu and Osamu are both at home and just doing some weird things on their phone. Until the doorbell rings. Tsumu. Why do I have to open it? Because I don't want to. And I think it's for you. Maybe it's Suna. Suna comes over in two hours. If he's here this early, it's definitely an imposter and not my Rintarao. Okay okay I'll open it. Reluctantly, Atsumu walks towards the door. When he opens it, he expects nobody special, but who he sees before him, is definitely someone special. Happy Valentine's Day. The setter stares for a few seconds confused at his boyfriend and when he's finally convinced his eyes aren't betraying him, he runs up to the other boy and catches him in a hug. Normally, Sakusa would have felt uncomfortable when someone suddenly touches him, but for some reason, the physical attention Atsumu gives him doesn't bother him at all. He feels like coming home. Atsumu feels like home. I missed you Omi. I also missed you. But I'm here. Yes. You are here. Osamu and Suna. Osamu. Tomorrow is Valentine's Day, right? Yes. What about it? So I was thinking. Do you have something planned tomorrow? To be honest, not really. I planned something for Atsumu with Sakusa, but I was only part of the planning and timing you know. Wait, what did you plan with Atsumu's boyfriend? He's coming to Hie Prefecture. He wanted to see Atsumu again and because my brother is a hopeless romantic, he thought Atsumu would like to spend this day with him. Not gonna lie, that's hella cute. For real though. If Atsumu ever dumps that Sakusa guy, I'll shove an anijiri down his throat. Good plan. You in for some anijiri and chill tomorrow? Sure. Tomorrow at 3, my place? Yes. Maybe I can finally meet that Omi guy Atsumu keeps talking about in real life. He probably is here for a few days. So you'll definitely see him. I can't wait. Let's make some plans tomorrow of how we're going to embarrass Atsumu in front of his precious Omi. We're definitely gonna do that. I'll make sure everything is on tape. Can't wait to rewatch those clips with you. But let's be honest. The dates where we watch all our embarrassing Atsumu clips are the best. For real. How can that guy find so much ways to do embarrass himself and do the most stupid things? How are we even related? Do I need to explain how twins works? No. Inoshita and Tanaka. This happens in real life. Just as planned, Tanaka and Inoshita met up at the park between their houses on February the 14th. Tanaka didn't have a clue what was going on and was surprised when he saw Inoshita instead of Nishinoa. Unlike Tanaka, Inoshita knew exactly what was going on. Sugora explained everything to him and had convinced him to confess, which was very hard to honest, but the silver-haired boy knew how to play his cards right when the moment calls for it. Hey Inoshita. Have you seen Noya anywhere? No sorry. I think Nishinoya is going on a date with Asahi today, remember? Oh right. Wait a second. That little bastard tricked me. It's not that I don't like being here with you. It's just. Why do I keep talking? Hush. I get your point. But you're here for a reason. So not the reason that Noya wanted me to go out on my saddest day of the year? No. I hope I can make this the most happiest day of your year. What was that? Nothing. Uum Tanaka. Yes. This is probably going to be really cheesy, but please listen. I'll listen to every last word of it. Okay so um, Where do I start? This is a lot harder than I thought it would. Don't worry. I won't judge you or anything. Okay. Um. So we know each other a few years already. Honestly, at first I thought you were a delinquent and all, but after I got to know you, I got to see the real side of you. And let me tell you that you are literally one of the most sweet and caring guys that I know. Like seriously, you would go through fire for someone who's dear for you. SHSHS you're over exaggerating. No I'm not. But anyway, I slowly got really attached to this side of you. And not only that side. How do I put this into words? In other words. I fell in love with you. And I still deeply am. Wait. I need some time to breathe. Where is oxygen when you need it the most? 
This isn't a prank, is it? No it isn't. Am I dreaming? Number. You're not dreaming either. Wait. So this is real? Like, real real? This is happening in real life? Yes. I can't believe it. I'm so happy. The boy who I am in love with also in love with me. Wait. You're also in love with me? Yes. Very in love. Do you want to be my boyfriend then? Yes. Are you stupid? How can I decline that? So we're dating now? Absolutely yes. Let's go. Where to go? Let's go a cafe so we can do all those romantic couple things people do during Valentine's Day.